I don't have to tell you that the flu is hitting hard right now. Chances are you're related to someone or work with someone who's had it. And the influx is causing some problems at local hospitals and doctor's offices. They're running out of the rapid flu test. Health editor Dr. Maria Simbra takes a look at the issue new at five. The flu has hit so hard and heavy this year, some doctors are running out of supplies. I've heard from private practices that they're running short on the rapid flu tests. I think they could make some decision on who was most important to get the test on, who was most at risk, um, and use the small number that they might have left. Restocking these 10-minute tests isn't so easy. We went to purchase more because of the use we've had this year, and they're not available. Other places are in good shape. I think a lot of it's proactive. Our supply chain folks have done a really good job of managing it, monitoring it, and try to keep our orders coming in on time. The test involves swabbing the back of the nose or throat to check for influenza DNA. Oh, it takes 10 minutes. But you don't need a test to tell if you have the flu. If someone looks like they have a flu with the fever, myalgias, or body aches, and, um, and we know that it's running rampant in the population, you probably don't need to do a flu test, even a rapid flu test. The latest numbers from the Allegheny County Health Department are more than 4,000 cases so far this flu season. That's twice as many as the same time last year. There have been some deaths, too. Coming up at 6, I'll tell you how many and what symptoms signal that you should get medical attention. I'm Dr. Maria Sembra, KDKA TV News.